okay, so you're facing 30 life and you actually start the trial. Mm -hmm. How much money did you spend in that case with all the lawyers and everything? I had a team of three attorneys and I spent, I don't want to exaggerate, because they end up paying for everybody else's lawyers too. I spent over half a million dollars in, 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 in attorney fees. Okay. And with that half a million you spent, you actually ended up being found guilty. Yes. It was a jury verdict? Yes, I went to trial. Okay. When you heard guilty at 34, 35 years old, how'd you feel? Oh, I don't even know how I feel. I think the wind was knocked out of me, but it was, you know, pretty much expected because when people bought 150 some keys and then $3 million cash and there's a black guy with a $2,000 suit on, I'm guilty. Jesus Christ, it, Jesus Christ is going to be hard to beat that one. I mean, what was the defense? Like, how did you try to get out of it? Well, I never got caught with anything. Everybody else got caught. And then all the drugs that they brought in the federal case is from the state case. So how are you going to prove I can, they ain't got me on tape giving nobody nothing. They don't have me on tape making no drug deals or nothing. Well, so how do they convict you? If everyone, if all the, your co-defendants are not cooperating, they, they haven't caught you with anything. So, hold on, let me back up. My co-defendants in my state case did not cooperate. The Fed case, they put me on with a bunch of cats. I, only, I ain't even know these cats. But the main guy I was serving, he cooperated. He went down there and went platinum. He went double platinum. Luther <laughs> Vandross, double platinum. He's working on diamond status. The man is a cold rat in a B-I-T-C-H, all caps. And he cooperated completely against oh you. Oh, my God. Took the man. stand and everything? Did he take the stand? He did the, you out. He did the Watusi. He took the stand. <laughs> Uh, he was cold. He was a cold-blooded man. The man pointed me out, and I ain't do nothing but make the man a millionaire. And he he returned the favor by saying, "Hey, I got caught talking on the phone about drugs. I got caught with all this money. I got caught with drugs. I got set up by my own cousin. So let me just let me just do something to the guy that did the most for me. Mm. Hey, he pointed me out. Uh, he ended up he ended up getting like five years. And then when he took the stand. He's trying to give me life because the case carried 30 to life. The feds told me if I go to trial, they're going to give me life because of all the stuff that's attached to me. And they, they, this, and you ask, how can you get convicted? I told you the state and the feds is different. At the time I went to trial, uh, they use a lot of revelant conduct. You know, people can just come in there and say, oh, I bought because this dude say he bought. I sold him 60 keys. That's just the most arbitrary number in the world. They made him say that because. Anything over 50 keys is, you know, this 30 to life category. So he put me at the 60. Mm -hmm. So so uh, 50 to 150 keys is the same amount. You get the same time. And then 150 keys to infinity is the same amount of time. So, you know, it's, it's a strategic thing, man. Uh, I ain't mad at the cat, man. You know, he, he got to live with the label of a rat and I got to live with the label of a boss and a stand-up guy.